take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. The types of mold found in grocery items might provoke nausea, vomiting, or mild allergic reactions, but it's unlikely you'll need to seek medical attention. Just don't think toasting bread will kill the spores. It won't. Make your mark, take our lead. For food safety experts, the answer is clear. Moldy bread is bad news. But otherwise, it should be tossed. The fact that bread is sliced is no guarantor that mold hasn't spread. I have seen mold spread from one slice to the next, she says. Take our lead. What temperature kills mold spores in food? Most molds are killed off by temperatures of 60 to 70 degrees Celsius, 140 to 160 degrees Fahrenheit. Also keep in mind that the mycotoxins produced by certain mold can survive intense heat. Boiling may kill the mold but leave its poison still intact. Let's help you make your mark. Of course if you make your own and skip the preservatives, the bread will mold even faster. Heat, humidity and light are all bad for bread but great for fungi or mold. So consider your fridge your best bet to keep your bread fresh and yummy. Tightly sealing the bread also helps slow the molding process. Take our lead. High or low temperatures can kill mold spores. There are several methods of removing mold, many of which necessitate the use of harsh chemicals. Temperature change is another way to clean mold. Extreme heat or extreme cold can kill most mold spores. Take our lead. Mold grows from tiny spores that float around in the air. When some of these spores fall onto a piece of damp food, they grow into mold. A common mold that grows on bread looks like white cottony fuzz at first. If you watch that mold for a few days, it will turn black. Let's help you make your mark. Is mold killed by cooking? Just heating a food to the boiling point does not kill the molds. Boiling for many minutes at a higher temperature or baking does kill them, but not ergot, another mold, and also destroys aflatoxin they produced and left in the food. Let's help you make your mark. The bread is bombarded with microwaves for about 10 seconds, which kills the mold spores, said Chief Executive Officer Don Stoll said. After 60 days, researchers found the treated bread that remained packaged had the same mold content when compared to a freshly baked loaf, Stoll said. Take our lead. For food safety experts, the answer is clear. Moldy bread is bad news. Some molds, like those used for gorgonzola cheese, are safe to eat. But the mold dotting bread isn't a benign source of extra fiber. Gravely says people who eat moldy food may suffer allergic reactions and respiratory problems. Let's help you make your mark. Black bread mold usually appears as fuzzy blue or green patches on the surface of the bread. Certain molds can cause severe allergic reactions in some people. However, for most people, eating black bread mold is not dangerous, though it can cause nausea, indigestion and vomiting.
Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.